name's Evan. Uh, my name is Tara. Uh, I'm the president of the Trans Listening Circle at BU. Uh, the whole show started as an idea to raise awareness on campus for the trans community so that we could get more support to change some policies. But as we were brainstorming, it grew into a fundraiser and our faculty advisor, Stacy Ulrich, suggested fundraising for Youth on Fire because of them at being at risk of closing their doors, essentially. Which, even though it's not a problem now, they're gonna be open for the next year, it's still a wonderful organization to fundraise for. And I'm so, so glad that Severity Stone and the Boston Sisters of Perpetual Indulgence and even some students donated their time to put together such an amazing show. My name is Dylan, um, but when I'm pretending to be a woman, my name is Pumpkin Spice. Um, and I think the show is an incredibly important thing, first of all, because it benefits a spectacular cause that does amazing, amazing work, and it's an organization that is, unfortunately, struggling a lot financially, so anything that can be done to help bolster it, I feel, should be done. Um, but also, I just think um, drag is really, really quickly becoming a quote-unquote mainstream art form and I think the more that a university like BU can do to support their students who are interested in that and the more they can do to really give that space and give that light I think is, is awesome so the more that I can be involved in helping shed those lights the more I, I want to be. We ask you to live your life in a way that is going to make you as happy and as satisfied as possible providing that you're not harming yourself or others along the way. And for that, we grant you a perpetual indulgence, meaning you get to go wherever you feel you want to go when you leave this plane of consciousness with no guilt, no shame, and certainly no judgment left on you at all. Okay, it's heavy. It's heavy. All right. Hello, my name is Stella Electra. Miss Electra is a little too formal, that's my mother, but we can call me Stella. So, um, so one of my good friends, Ter, whose boyfriend, Evan, is, um, you know, kind of organized the whole thing. Um, when he asked me to do it, I, like, jumped at the chance. Because, you know, I've been on this train for a while trying to get into drag, and, you know, there was like, oh my god, there's a show happening at BU, you should totally be in it, and, you know, here we are. And, you know, I think, like, just, I've always really been, like, attracted to the art form, kind of, because, like, you know, it's a great, not only is it a great way to, like, express things that, you know, the center cares so much about, you know, like, gender and have, like, complex talks about that kind of stuff. But I mean, you know, just kind of put into the room, the fact that it's happening here is, you know, a miracle in itself. These are the conversations we got to kind of start having, so, you know, having these kinds of shows and inviting, you know, like, literally everybody you know is the first step, so, you know. I'm so thrilled. <laughs> <laughs> To release my inner fantasy, see this of a winner and know that you.